And welcome back, everybody, to another session of Gaming with God. I'm your host, Grumpy Old Dude. And today we return to Borderlands for episode 14 in our playthrough. Rust Commons West. Last time up, we did a couple of the initial um, quests within the Rust Commons West. We cleared the sewage blockage. We got the engine parts. We recovered the uh, scavenger hunt for the submachine gun parts. And now, the Hidden Journal is up next. So, we, according to our map, need to go back through this thing. Actually, that's not necessarily true. We can go another route. There are several ways to accomplish this. I don't want fast travel. Okay, now we're not going to drive very damn far. We're only going to drive to right here. One more just for grins. Okay, now he's got a turret right up there. Sniper rifle, corrosive abilities. There we are. Obviously, I don't bother finding the uh, journals in sequence. They tell a nice story when you do them in sequence. They tell a nice story uh, when you do them in sequence. Since I've played the game so many times. Oh. Played so many times I didn't know that you couldn't run, just run over a boulder. 
Very good there, Grumpy. and stuff. Spin some sideways, dazes them. There's that group homo. Alright, it's time to put the heavy shield up now instead of the uh, regenerating one. Let's get our big shield up. While we're at it, let's swap out from the 35 transfusion to the 58 transfusion. We don't want to hit those barrels with this thing because, whoops, those will explode. Okay. Corrosive damage. See how little good that's doing? Good lord. It's like accomplishing nothing at all. doesn't do enough damage quickly enough. Giant ones take me, take some killing. They can take some killing. What's our inventory look like now? We're at 14 to 24. We're all right. Still pick up 10 somethings or other. Me, there's one right here, too.
you don't want to die, you shouldn't ought to have shot at me. It's a different mission that's there, not that one. Okay. Oops. I got turned around sideways. Oh, there it is. Day 493. Doll Corporation just shut down their mining operations here on Pandora. I think they are insane. Or that is, whoever is making the decision is insane. Iridium mining on this planet has been hugely lucrative for Dahl, and has funded my project. It's been especially profitable given how low their labor costs are. I wonder what Dahl will do with all the unpaid convicts they've been using to work their mines. I wonder if any of them will be my friend. What? Why are you always so jealous of me getting new friends? I'm turning you off. Little baby spiderlings. Okay, I got them. There he is. Big bad rack that was there. Apparently, Bloodling won't attack him. Okay. We want experience points, so we're going to kill things again. And that's how we level up. <clears throat> and we like leveling up. Another walking meat puppet! Oh, I got two of these guys coming at me, huh? Where's my shotgun? There you are. Place our expended ammo. Always use those environmental barrels. When the bad guys are standing near those colored barrels like that, blow them up. They can take those bad guys down too. You know, how are we on ammo? Full, full, not full, not full, not full. Yep, we're going to open ammo crates. We have three different varieties of ammo we can pick up. Now, how are we? 
Not full, not full, not full. Still got three varieties of ammo we can pick up. Might be almost time to head back to a vending machine and do some inventory reduction here. So machine gun and shotgun ammo is all we can pick up now. And inventory wise we're at 21 of 24. Yeah, we're gonna go to a vending machine. Reduce our inventory. 22 of 24. That was the end of the ammo there. Actually, I think it might be alright to go a little farther yet. Now, right here, we're going to get a bunch of spider ants. And got them. I think that's all 24, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. It's time to go to a vending machine. <laughs> oh, you didn't like that? Are you about ready to get rolling? Really? Here, right there. Nothing I want. Nothing, nothing. Oh, nice pistol skills. Da, 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 da. Oh, the rack's coming back. Let's see here. I sell that. Explosive sticky. I like those. I might have use for that. I'm going to hang on to that. Assault rifles. Yes, yes. Um, no. No. Yes. No, no, no. Yes, yes. No, no. Okay. Uh, maybe. 13 of 24. And I am carrying three healing kits. That's part of what I've got. Where's the other one? The one that called me a bastard. There you are. Jodo! Now I go through here again. Here we come to here. All right, boys, take them out. Cut them down. Yeah. There's no escaping, Mark. 
Who's got the big bad machine? You did. Sniper rifle. Where are we ammo wise now? Not full, not full. Revolver and submachine gun ammo. 19 of 24 already. We picked up a lot of goodies right there. The healing syringe. You can't carry those. They just get used on. Uh... Oh. As I work, I spend the majority of days having conversations with people that are not there. Two days ago, I explained to my mother how the translation program I was writing would greatly help me understand exactly what all this arid and text I've been attempting to decipher actually means. My mother has been dead for six years. She was never actually interested in science to begin with. I'm unsure if I'm quite to the point of no return, but my stubbornness, which I got from her in the first place, will keep me here putting up with her until I find exactly where the vault is, or until I drive myself so far off the edge I do not remember why I was doing this in the first place. Lots of containers to pilfer from. Two journal entries left. Your spiderlings here. By far, the easiest way to deal with them is let them identify themselves by moving and then run them over. Okay, now there is here a fire breathing rack, shotgun. There you are. Rack and issue, that's it. Blood's not going to help. Man, a shotgun's not doing any help a lot of good, is it? Let's go to the explosive machine gun.
going through the ammo, aren't I? Another trophy from my wall. Okay, that looks like it. That's where I prefer weapons with scopes on them. Much easier to use them in an AA roll. Now, give me all those machine gun rounds I can possibly find again. Scientific Advisor, Doll Corporation, Day 224. The only conversations I have anymore are with this Echo Recorder. I've developed a relationship with it. Some cycles I sleep with it, and others I make it stay outside of my tent. My waning ability to discern logic from insanity is becoming cumbersome. I've been translating Aridan writings in between arguing with the Recorder. You went off for a few hours during my last sleep cycle. I heard you. If I were to pontificate, I would infer that the Aridan writings show a class-based society that was quite capable of both leadership and of armed conflict. Okay. Sorry to interrupt you there, Ingleberry. 180, 100. And drop the health kit. I can pick that up. Another L case that I can't I don't have room for. Alright. We have one more journal entry to find. I think I know I remember that where that one is. Bunch of silly donuts here. know how ineffective that is. What, you didn't like that? <laughs> I did. I quite liked that. The last journal entry is right up here on the wall. Here it is. Day 457. This is exciting. I think I might strip naked and run around to celebrate, but I'll, I'll do it during the dim cycle for fear of prying eyes. Before overloading and melting four of my computer's 13 qubit operators, my program was able to decipher quite a bit more than I had been able to understand before. It will take a few days to fix, but I was able to find many repeated instances of an event that takes place every 200 years. It's repeated many times with a symbol that looks not unlike a circle with an upside down V in it. It's possible that this is the vault. And something about the vault happens every 200 years. Tonight, for dinner, I will have a... Oops. That's all of them. Now we're going to go find Patricia Tanner. Tannis. Seek out Tannis. That is next on our agenda. Shotgun. Thank you.
Crap, I've got a big one here. giant ones there. I was just, apparently I was too close to them and they were looking big. Okay, now we have a rack alley here. And I think there's another giant spider link through here. <laughs> Excuse me. Yep, right here. Inventory. We're all healthy, so drop, drop, and drop. Before we go inside and meet Patricia Tannis. We empty contents right here. All right. You're from off planet. You smell oddly. Seek out Tannis. The crazy Earl. Okay, now. Your eyes open. We can only take two pieces. Now we're full up. That is significant because there are two more gun chests on the way out of here. Whoops. And I jumped too far. It's all right. One of the gun chests is right up there. The other one's right here. But I have zero inventory capacity. So I don't want to burn those. Now what I was going to do was end the episode after I got to this point, but instead I'm going to clear the inventory, get back in there, back up, there you go. Let's come over here to the vending machines, clear our inventory, come back over there and hit those two gun racks, gun cases, before everything respawns. 
Ooh, 40% blood leaks. Fast hand dryness, remember you swipe, reload, a little bit of everything. Give up one regen, get a lot of other stuff. That's all right. I'm not going to bother with that right now. Um, I'm going to sell that one. I'm going to sell that one, and that one, and that one, and that one. Only six rounds. We're going to sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Yeah, that does 33 twice. That one does 35 twice. So we're going to sell this one. Back into where Tannis is. Before everything respawns, we'll run through here. Didn't do it for any respawn. Thin the herd there, brother. Back up. What kind of goodies did you drop? Money. So much easier when I go over. Damn it. See how far it jumps. Not that far. So how come I keep jumping over it? There. There we go. Oh. I've never 
tried to go this way. Because you can't. Okay. Both hands. Walk, sprint, and jump. There. All that for that little bit of stuff. <laughs> so you want me to share, huh? Not that much in there either. Twenty to twenty-four. Okay, now there is one spot nearby. There's just a couple of racks to deal with, and it's a cash rich spot. I mean, you, you find a weapon at this stage, it's going to be worth more than the cash we're about to find, but. I keep forgetting, is there a toolkit in here with money in it, too? No. There is not. Okay. Oh, hell, yeah, a bunch of stuff stayed up above there. these cash boxes. See how much there is. 28. 60. 130. 208. 235. 263. 393. 400. And 23. Quarter box. Plus all the neat goodies that the racks dropped. Inventory reduction, and then we'll call this an episode. Let's see where we at here. We got our healing kits back. That's nice. Okay. Twelve rounds is all. I'm not a fan of those. Only 19% accuracy. Insufficient. Now we're carrying 13 items. What's he got for a shield here? Oh, that's corrosive damage, corrosive resistance, lethal strike, corrosive damage. Okay. Comment down below, folks. Click that like button. Hit subscribe if you haven't already. Share these videos with your friends. Some of them are going to like Borderlands. Maybe we get some more people discussing things and asking questions, commenting, so on and so forth. Take care of yourselves, stay safe, have fun. I do appreciate, I genuinely do, that you take your time to watch some of these. I thank you for that. Till we see each other again. Boy, my camera's way off base here, isn't it? Good Lord. Hi there. <laughs> Till we see each other again, stay safe, have fun. Bye-bye.